learning of books historically practiced by institutions like the Roman Catholic Church's Index Liborum Pro Prohibitorum Librorum Prohibitorum and the Nazi regime serves as a poignant reminder of the dangers associated with censoring information from the suppression to eh, from the suppression of dissenting voices to the obliteration of entire bodies of knowledge history has shown that controlling information can have severe consequences this echoes into the present digital age where attempts to censor online content may inadvertently amplify its significance as seen in the streisand effect rest in peace the library of alexandria the streisand effect the streisand effect is a phenomenon where attempts to suppress information lead to increased attention Named after Barbara Streisand's effort to conceal images of her Malibu home, this effect is a cautionary tale for those seeking to censor information online. In the digital realm, the more one tries to hide or restrict information, the more likely it is to gain widespread visibility, illustrating the counterproductive nature of censorship. The QAnon Phenomenon QAnon is a contemporary conspiracy theory that gained prominence in part due to its suppression by mainstream sources. The secrecy and attempts to censor discussions around QAnon fueled curiosity, attracting individuals who sought forbidden or hidden knowledge. This example illustrates how attempts to suppress information can inadvertently contribute to the growth of fringe beliefs and conspiracy theories. The Red Scare, particularly in the mid-20th century United States, involved intense efforts to root out perceived communist influences. This era saw censorship and restrictions on certain ideologies, leading to challenges for law enforcement researchers. Similarly, in the present digital age, banning extremist content online can hinder efforts to monitor and counter such groups, showcasing the ongoing struggles with information control across different historical contexts. In this cosmic collaboration, we delve into the complexities of banning or censoring certain information, drawing parallels to historic instances like the 